guys welcome back to my channel I hope you can hear me quite well you're not gonna see me today because well we're going to be doing a swatch video and um, it's on the BH cosmetics zodiac palette um, I'm hoping to keep this video short which is another reason why I'm not featuring in my channel today because I have a tendency to talk so hopefully I can do this justice I mean it's not gonna be the best video that's out there but hopefully you get an idea on what I'm talking about so um, here's what the palette looks like sort of inside I do need to mention that um, I did forget to swatch the highlighter um, but I'll insert a photo somewhere on the line, maybe a little bit later throughout the video um, to show you what that looks like. It's really hard to actually project um, what it actually looks like. So it's, it's, yeah, it's quite difficult. It's not the best highlighter either. Um, as I'm going through the video, I will try and throw in some um, photos as well because I've got, I've, I've done some video with two different video cameras, one with my iPhone and the other one with um, my JVC um video camera. Is it JVC? Yeah, my JVC video camera. So, um, yeah. I, I think these are powdery, but they do go on the eyes nicely if you know, once you learn how to use them properly. Um, there's some beautiful colours. So, uh, yeah. Let's get started. If you hear any clicking, I apologise. Alright, so we're gonna start with the, um, the shimmer shades first, and We'll swatch all the shimmer shades and then we'll go on to the mattes. There's 12 shimmer shades, 12 mattes and obviously one highlighter. So we're going to start off with Capricorn. Alright, so we're starting off with Capricorn like I said. Uh, they do look much better in person. Um, later on I'll move the camera a little bit so you can see. This one is Sagittarius. I love that colour. absolutely love it and I'm going to play with that one. This one's Scorpio. It's kind of like a, I don't know, goldy copper. This one's mine, which is Libra, which um, in person looks a bit reddy, pinky. It's really hard to describe, but it's absolutely gorgeous. Then we're moving on to Virgo, which is a little bit lighter. Um, this one you have to work with a little bit, I feel, when you're putting it on the eyes and yeah, on the fingers. This one is Leo, which is a little bit pinker than the last one. The last one's more champagne. This next one is Cancer, another gorgeous colour, absolutely love that one. Next one is Gemini, which I think is a little boring myself, but could be nice as a topper. Next one is Taurus, which I'm not sure how to explain that one, but it's still gorgeous. Then we're moving on to Aries, another beautiful colour, looks similar as the um, Sagittarius but blue instead of green. It's Like I said, it's hard to show. Then we're moving on to Pisces. And then the last one would be Aquarius. Where are you? There we go. And there's Aquarius right there. And I'll swatch the matte ones just above um, where the shimmer shades are in the same order. So starting with Capricorn. Yeah, there's me just doing a little one over, catching some light. There you go, don't mind the freckles. <laughs> uh, they are gorgeous though. Here we go. I'm behind. So Capricorn is a army greenish, I want to say. Yeah, it's not a very good swatch, but there you go. Um, then Sagittarius, a, um, a warmy brown, which I personally think would go better with Scorpio. Then we have Scorpio's Matte, which is a, a darker brown. Then on to Libra, which is kind of like a grey black, I guess. It's kind of like a weak black, not really that impressive, if you ask me. Kind of looks a bit blue. Then we have Virgo's Peachy Colour, which is hard to show up on the skin as a swatch, but, you know... It is quite nice, um, be a nice base colour. Then we have Leo, which is like a, it looks more like a wine in person, but it's a, it's a purple, obviously. It's a purple, but in the palette looks wine. Then we have Cancers, which is definitely a purple. Um, yeah, it looks different on the skin as it does in the palette, but still absolutely gorgeous. Moving on to Gemini's purple, which is very similar if you ask me. Um, just a little bit more, uh, I don't know, light bluey than purple. 
but still gorgeous. Then we have Taurus's kind of purpley shade, a bit, a bit darker. Um, be good for smoking out. Then we're going to move on to Aries, which is jet black, as you can see. And um, that's what I want in my blacks, none of that weak stuff that they've got for Libra. But anyway, then we're going on to Pisces, which is another brown. Um, I like that brown. That one's a bit more cool toned, I would, I would, I'd like to say. Then Aquarius, we have sort of like a beige, a beigey colour. Now this is where I should have put the, um, the highlighter and I've completely forgotten. So I will insert some highlighter swatch there somewhere. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Like, honestly, um, it swatches alright. It's a little bit harder with brushes. Um, they are definitely buildable. Um, they do kick up a bit. Uh, so, yeah, just watch out for that. Um, but, yeah, I love, I love this palette. I love these colours. And um, I'm hoping to do some tutorials soon or some get readies with me using these colours. Um, some of them require a little bit more work than others, but they are absolutely gorgeous. I love them and um, Yeah, if you enjoyed this video feel free to give me a thumbs up and a like and um, Well, that's the same thing and uh, if you want to see more videos like this go ahead and subscribe um, Go ahead check the bell that makes sure that you'll get all of the notifications um, all of my posts and um, Yeah, thank you very much guys and um, enjoy your weekend Bye